All right, new shot here. Let's see. Whoa, bit fast. <laughs> Interesting. So the tricky thing to me is, given this rig's realistic appearance, like stuff like that, when you break it so much, and the speed being so fast, it's a bit of an odd contrast. Yes, there's some stylization in terms of scale, you know, muscles, small head, all that stuff. But overall, it seems fairly realistic looking. So it's just, it's a bit of a, of a strong contrast to me. But at the same time, it has good rhythm. Yeah, definitely interesting moves. There's a lot of stuff going on here with little pieces here. So I will keep that arm out for silhouette just a bit cleaner away from this. And it's so dark that we're starting to kind of lose what's going on through here. So you might want to have a different move on that arm so we don't lose it through these sections there. And then you have like this arm going back. Again, we lose it because of the swords. Is he using? No, right? So it's almost like you could hide those guys. I would hide that pull vector thing that's there. <laughs> this is a pretty hefty jump for a foot roll. So it feels a bit strong. Again, it goes into the whole stylization thing. That's a bit much. Jump wise, watch out. We're going up and then we're holding here. Meaning that you go up and then you can see how that head is kind of stuck in space. It's like you're pivoting off of here. So much movement through here while this is kind of stuck. So I would still go up here, up here again, up here again, and then start to drop, and then start to drop. Let's tweak that a little bit. And this is a bit... Uh, this extends definitely first, but then one frame is not a massive difference. So it's a, it's a bit of a post-to-post -post feel where we're just hitting this bow, almost on the same frame. Interesting pose. I'm not sure what is he doing. Is he grabbing something? Like what is going on with that hand pose? <laughs> Some crazy breaks there. Definitely clean pose here. Definitely frozen here. And we almost overshoot a bit and come back. We're a bit locked and then almost frozen. I see some drift to the right, but it's a bit frozen. That's fun. I definitely like that. Like that last move is fun there. I just don't know what he's doing. And this is not because it's wrong. It's just, I just don't know. <laughs> so I'm going to admit ignorance here. Like, what is he doing here? If he would hold on to a grenade and that was it in there. And that's why the fingers are cut like this. And then it shoots out. And then because he can't really... Unless he's holding it, holding it, holding it, and it opens the hand and it goes up, lands, but then he doesn't kick it out, then it will kick it out more again this way. So again, I'm not quite sure what is going on in terms of the action. And to me, just it's a bit of a style break from the look versus the animation where you can still do all this, but I would reduce that amount of breaking, but that's also subjective. Like animation wise, besides some of these spacing issues and a little bit of silhouette clarity, it's nice. It has a good rhythm. I like the little adjustments in the legs and the feet here, that little slide back, that little hop there. So this is cool. The last gesture is fun <laughs> with the head too. Yeah, so it's more like maybe I'm old, <laughs> confused about things. But little tweaks and polish on the animation. Watch out for the spacing. There's otherwise some really good stuff in there. And then it's going to depend how you're going to present this. Like this on an empty background with this plane cut off here. These uh, knee pull vectors sticking out. Just you have to work on, on giving us some more context. Or if you want this to be just in an empty room, I would actually take out that plane. So I don't know. I need a bit more information in terms of what is going on, what you're trying to do, what the actions are meant to be. Is someone else going to be in there? I'm just seeing here you're practicing body mechanics. I mean, if it's a practice thing, it doesn't really matter in terms of presentation. But yeah, 
that's kind of that. Let me know. Maybe, you know, anything that I missed so that I can give you a clear feedback round. Maybe a part two. Especially, like, what is going on here? <laughs> and that's that. No, All I'm right. Thinking. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm.